Pluto is a faraway and jumbling planet that was once fundamental to our nearby planetary system's family. Anyway, disturbing statements by leading astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and MIT's Michio Kaku have carried Pluto back into the spotlight with a frightening revelation. They suggest that it is on a potential path to collide with Neptune. Yet, how could this happen, and what may be the consequences of such a tremendous event? Are we seeing an approaching collision, or is there something more to this oncoming titanic accident? Join us as we investigate the potential consequences of a Pluto-Neptune collision. Pluto, a former planet that was reclassified as a dwarf planet partly due to its unusual orbit, remains a subject of interest and study in the scientific community. According to recent estimates by leading experts, Pluto's orbit is dangerously close to Neptune's. Astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku are both raising the alarm about a potential collision between these two planets that could have massive implications for Earth. How is such an event even possible? Pluto's journey around the Sun is unlike that of any other planet in our nearby planetary system. It takes a staggering 248 years to complete a single orbit, meaning that since its discovery in 1930, it hasn't even completed one full revolution. However, the intrigue doesn't stop there. Pluto's orbit is marked by its highly distorted shape, straying dramatically from the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. What makes Pluto's orbit even more curious is its inclination, tilted at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane. The way Pluto follows its path is far more extreme compared to other planets. This tilt and irregularity add layers of complexity to its orbital dynamics. Perhaps one of the most fascinating aspects of Pluto's orbit is its intersection with Neptune's orbit. For nearly 20 years in each orbit, Pluto actually comes closer to the Sun than Neptune, defying what we might expect based on their positions in the solar system. This leads to the natural question, why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational effects of other planets. The study of Pluto's orbit began shortly after its discovery. Initially, astronomers struggled to understand its odd path. Unlike the other planets, whose orbits lie relatively close to the ecliptic plane, Pluto stands out with its steep tilt and irregular shape. The mystery deepened with the realization that Pluto's orbit does, in fact, cross Neptune's. The complexity of Pluto's orbit amid these peculiarities is evidence of the intricacies of space mechanics. The three-body problem in space involves figuring out how three objects, like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, move and influence each other with their gravity. It's like trying to predict where they will go based on where they start and how they pull on each other. In Pluto's case, this problem shows how its orbit, Neptune's path, and the Sun's gravity all interact in a complicated way. The terms alpha libration and degree libration, along with the VZK effect, are crucial to this issue, according to astrophysicists. Alpha libration, in Pluto and Neptune's context, means that when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is positioned about 90 degrees away from Neptune. This spatial separation is critical in preventing their orbits from affecting each other. Degree libration, on the other hand, refers to the vertical movement of a celestial body in its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it comes closest to Neptune or another giant planet, it is positioned well above their orbital plane, providing extra protection from potential collisions. Another significant factor is the VZK effect, named after three scientists, Wisniak, Zipel, and Kaula, who studied how objects move in space. It's about how three celestial bodies like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun pull on each other with their gravity. This pull affects how they move. For Pluto, the VZK effect helps explain why its orbit around the Sun is so unusual. Despite Pluto's orbit seeming chaotic, this effect keeps it moving smoothly. The VZK effect shows that even though things in space might appear wild and unpredictable, certain patterns and rules maintain control. These factors help keep Pluto's orbit stable, ensuring it doesn't collide with Neptune or lose its course. This three-body problem helps us understand how these orbits change based on how these celestial bodies pull on each other. Focusing on this helps us learn more about Pluto, our solar system, and distant stars and galaxies. Mathematical simulations in the late 1980s revealed that despite these stabilizing factors, Pluto's orbit is still somewhat chaotic, with minor variations in starting conditions leading to significant differences over long periods. However, these extraordinary properties of Pluto's orbit have been found to maintain stability over extremely long timescales, effectively keeping chaos in check. 
Recent computer models have helped scientists understand how giant planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn influence Pluto's path around the Sun. Neptune has a unique relationship with Pluto, where for every three orbits Neptune makes around the Sun, Pluto completes two. This resonance helps keep Pluto's orbit stable. However, Neptune is not alone in this. Jupiter's gravity also plays a crucial role in protecting Pluto's orbit, and Saturn contributes as well. These simulations show that Jupiter's gravity alone is strong enough to keep Pluto on a steady path for billions of years. It seems that Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn work together to ensure Pluto continues its journey safely through space without encountering major issues. These gravitational phenomena are essential to understanding the universe, as they maintain the control and consistency of celestial bodies' movements. Without these forces, the solar system as we know it would be a far more chaotic and unpredictable place. Bodies like Pluto could crash into others or be ejected from their stable orbits, causing a chain reaction affecting other celestial bodies. For Pluto especially, with discussions about it potentially colliding with Neptune in the future, understanding its orbit is essential. This provides a clearer picture of the dynamics of our solar system. The case of Pluto demonstrates how even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve a state of balance through the intricate exchange of gravitational forces and orbital mechanics. It also highlights the importance of continuous observation and investigation of these phenomena to better understand our place in the universe. Exploring the depths of space often forces us to confront the strange nature of celestial bodies and Pluto's orbit. Is a perfect example of this oddity. The concept of orbital chaos, which refers to the delicate dependence of a celestial body's orbit on its initial conditions, is vividly illustrated in Pluto's case. This means that even slight changes in the dwarf planet's position or speed can significantly alter its long-term trajectory. In the vastness of our solar system, Pluto occupies a unique place that challenges our understanding of planetary classification and dynamics. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto has undergone extensive study, leading to significant discoveries about its structure and behavior. One of the most fascinating aspects of Pluto is its surface, a complex tapestry of ice, rock, and various compounds. NASA's New Horizons mission, which flew by Pluto in July 2015, provided unprecedented data about this distant world. Pluto's surface is characterized by vast plains, towering mountains, and deep valleys. One of the most remarkable features is Sputnik Planitia, a giant heart-shaped plane made primarily of nitrogen ice. This region showcases a variety of landforms, including massive ice sheets and what appear to be flowing glaciers. The presence of these features suggests that Pluto may still be geologically active, despite its immense distance from the Sun and extremely low temperatures. Another intriguing aspect of Pluto is its atmosphere, primarily composed of nitrogen with traces of methane and carbon monoxide. Pluto's atmosphere is thin yet exhibits fascinating seasonal variations. As Pluto approaches the Sun in its elongated orbit, its atmosphere can expand and contract. This dynamic behavior reflects the complex interaction between Pluto and its environment. During its closest approach to the Sun, some of the atmospheric gases may freeze out onto the surface, while as it moves farther away, these gases can sublimate back into the atmosphere. The interaction between Pluto and its largest moon, Charon, also adds complexity to the system. Charon is relatively large compared to Pluto, with a diameter about half that of Pluto itself. This size ratio means that the two bodies are in a mutual orbit around a point in space that lies between them, rather than Pluto simply orbiting Charon. This unique relationship contributes to the complex gravitational dynamics in the region, affecting the orbits of other objects in the Kuiper Belt. The Kuiper Belt, a region beyond Neptune populated with small icy bodies, is home to various other dwarf planets and potential impactors. This belt is a repository of ancient material from the early solar system, giving scientists a glimpse into its formation. Pluto's orbital characteristics might provide insights into the formation patterns of these distant objects, suggesting that interactions with larger planets may have played a crucial role in shaping their current orbits. One of the critical implications of understanding Pluto's orbital dynamics is its potential impact on how we comprehend the solar system's evolution. Gravitational interactions from neighboring giant planets like Jupiter and Neptune can alter the orbits of smaller bodies, including those in the Kuiper Belt. Such interactions can lead to changes in orbits, possibly resulting in collisions or ejections from the solar system entirely. As a result, understanding Pluto's orbit is not just about studying one distant world, but about unraveling the larger story of how the solar system has evolved over billions of years.
Understanding Pluto's complex orbital behavior also sheds light on the broader mechanics of planetary dynamics. The gravitational tug of war among the giant planets acts as a stabilizing force that keeps the solar system relatively orderly. Without this balance, smaller objects like Pluto could experience chaotic orbital shifts, potentially leading to catastrophic collisions. The role of resonance in orbital stability. One of the key mechanisms maintaining Pluto's stability is its orbital resonance with Neptune. This resonance occurs because Pluto completes two orbits around the Sun for every three orbits Neptune makes. This precise 2 to 3 ratio keeps the two celestial bodies from ever coming dangerously close to one another, despite their overlapping orbital paths. This resonance means that even though Pluto's orbit crosses Neptune's, the two planets are always positioned far enough apart due to the timing of their orbits. Essentially, they are locked into this orbital dance, ensuring that a collision remains virtually impossible under current conditions. Astrophysicists have also discovered that other celestial bodies in the Kuiper belt exhibit similar resonances with Neptune, further indicating that this orbital locking mechanism is a critical feature in maintaining the solar system's long-term stability. Numerical Simulations and Long-Term Projections Despite the protective nature of orbital resonance, long-term simulations suggest that Pluto's orbit isn't entirely immune to instability. Over millions or even billions of years, small gravitational influences from other planets, passing stars, or even unseen distant objects could slowly alter Pluto's path. These simulations show that while Pluto's current orbit is relatively stable, its future depends on maintaining the precise gravitational interactions that have kept it on course for so long. A slight disruption in the balance could cause Pluto's orbit to evolve unpredictably, potentially leading to an eventual departure from its current path. Exploring the Kuiper Belt and Beyond The study of Pluto has also fueled deeper exploration of the Kuiper Belt, where thousands of icy bodies reside. Many of these objects follow similarly elongated or tilted orbits, hinting at a complex past involving gravitational interactions with Neptune and other planets. The discovery of other dwarf planets like Eris, Haumea, and Makemake has reshaped our understanding of the outer solar system. These distant worlds share characteristics with Pluto, including unusual orbits and icy compositions, suggesting a shared history rooted in the chaotic early days of the solar system. Implications for Planetary Science and Space Exploration NASA's New Horizons mission, which provided unprecedented close-up images of Pluto in 2015, marked a significant milestone in planetary science. The detailed observations of Pluto's surface, atmosphere, and moons offered insights that far exceeded expectations, transforming our understanding of distant worlds. The mission revealed that Pluto is far more dynamic than previously thought. Its icy plains, towering mountains, and potentially active glaciers suggest that even in the frigid, distant reaches of the solar system, geological processes can persist. The discovery of cryovolcanoes and shifting ice flows points to the possibility of a subsurface ocean beneath Pluto's icy crust. If confirmed, this would raise fascinating questions about the potential for life in unexpected environments, even in the outer solar system.